It's Crane Robbie here, and welcome to another Rabbit Ramblings! Uh, in this episode, I want to talk about something that has been in my heart for a long time, since I was in middle school, high school, even now. I still have it in my heart, and it's because, well, it's just that I hate being number two. I hate being number two. Now what does that mean? I don't like being second to someone. And it's just, I feel like, at that point, I feel like I lost. Because I'm, I'm, I'm a sore loser, okay? Like, I'm just gonna put that out there. I am a sore loser. I've been trying to suppress that a lot now because, like, I know I get cocky or, like, I have, like, little banters with people whenever I play League of Legends, but... I... That's, that's not really exactly the point. The point is, like, I don't handle being second to someone or being compared to someone. Like... It, it makes sense, I guess, that I would because, like, I want to, like... I've been in this situation for a long time, just not being noticed, and, like, I didn't like that. I hated not being noticed. I, that that made me feel like number two to someone. The only person... Well, okay, before I actually get into that, let me just... Let me just explain a little bit more about this. I... Have talent. I have talent, I know that. Everybody I knew had some sort of talent as well. But in different aspects. As for me, I am a multi-talented person, but... In a sense that I'm not at the top of the talent chain, you know? Like... I can do things at a very high level, except there is always someone gonna be better than me. And I know that. I know that there's someone going to be better than me. But... I still hated the fact, you know? Like, it still makes me- it still hurts to be known as, oh, the person that was almost this person, you know? I just don't like being number two because, like, I- I'm a sore loser. I never like being below someone in terms of whatever aspect that they they're, they excel in. Because when I was younger, people would always rub their achievements in. Like, they'd rub it in my face or like in people's faces. Like, oh, I drew this. Or like, oh, I'm, I have the best score in basketball. I don't know. That's just like, I don't know. Like, oh, I can, I can shoot a basketball from full court or something, whatever. I, I don't care. I was able to do that too, but not to the same accuracy as other people, I guess. But whatever. I mean, like, I was never, I never liked being number two because of that reason. Nobody was humble. Nobody I knew during the time of, like, of, um, Middle school. Nobody was humble. Like, you'd see, like, they'd have the humble brag, of course, I guess, but most of them were just, they'd rub it in your face, and I didn't like that. The only person that was actually not like that, who was actually humble to me and to pretty much everyone else, was Foxy Kun, because he wouldn't, like, he wouldn't make it seem like they were worse than him. Because he was super multi-talented. In fact, I don't mind being number two to him, but he never he never thought of me as a number two. He thought of me as an equal or higher, and I don't know why. But that's how that's how he thought. And I love him for that. He's just he's wonderful. But enough about that. There's a lot of people I am not that the only reason why I bring up Foxy Kun is because there were people there are people like him that like, nowadays, that aren't like that, but... I mean, that aren't, like, humble and stuff, but... Most of them were, like, braggers and stuff. 
um, like, it's just unfortunate that I still hold this to my heart, because, like, it's not as bad. It's kind of like how, like, I didn't like my voice, but in this sense, I still hate being number two. I still make a fit, like, in League of Legends for losing the match because someone was better than me. But more than that, they were being cocky and stuff. Like, of course I was being cocky, but... I just hate being looked down upon. I think that's more of the reason why I hate being number two, is because people look down on me. Like, I hated being looked down on. People like Nyaners who, like, don't look down on me, they actually want to help out. I think they're cool. Like, people like... Lee Fuchi, people like Rennie, people like, um, yeah, there's people like Yui, people like, uh, who else? Uh, I can't think of anybody in the- Shiro! People like Shiro. People like Lily, people like, well, <laughs> one side of Lily, there's a, there's a savage side as well, but that's a different story. There are people that care. There are people that are humble, or too, like, way more humble than, like, the people I met in middle school and high school, for sure. And it's like, wow, and mind you, like, I knew, uh, uh, I, uh, I can't speak today. I knew everyone, like, I, like, I've seen everybody, but they, not all of them know me personally. In fact, I think a lot of people, if they see me, they won't even recognize me. Because it's like... What? Who are you? I never met you in, in middle school. Who the fuck are you? And... Whatever, that's... Uh... Eh! No, I don't care anymore. About that point, you know, But yeah, a lot of them were really... They're like huge, massive penises and... Like, wanted to stroke their e-penis a lot more, but... Whatever. It's fine. I... It's like... I have this channel with over 10,000 subscribers and... It's... It's... It's growing and... I can talk to everybody here. Like, I can speak my mind here and everyone's can Everyone's like cool and stuff. And I love it! I just love it! I love... I love talking to you guys. It's really fun. And like... Even though I hate it, people actually care. People actually care about me. Like... Like Lily, like Shiro, like Yui, like... Like, uh... Leafy, Leafuchi, like... Uh... Rini, and like... Downers, they care. They care about people, they care about everyone's skills, they can't. they care about, like, everyone's talents. And they're just examples, uh-uh, but... They actually care about, like, you and... Your talents, your skills. And they don't look down on you just because they're better than you in one aspect. Of course, there are times where there's gonna be arguments, but that's... That just happens in a bunch of friends. I, I don't know why I even brought that up, but you know. And then there are the numbers, you know? Like, numbers are still numbers. Like, even though I'm number two, that's just a number. Like, it could be like, off by one or two. Like, points. Like, vote points, I guess. From, like, whoever's in number one. So, like, it, it was, like, ev it's, like, even. It's, like, I don't know. You could call yourself number two, or you or you can call yourself... The number two that's, al that's also number one. I don't know. It's up to you to interpret whatever you think about what I'm talking about. Because, again, I love to ramble. This is the rabbit ramblings. I just ramble about whatever I want to talk about, and I love it. And also, I think I hit the microphone. Whoops, sorry. You might have, like, a huge somewhere there. Really, I'm really sorry about that. Anyways, uh, wow. Yeah, so, to recap, I hate being number two, and I'll always hate num being number two. But, um, I'll, I'm not going to, like, hate you. I ju I'm just gonna hate myself for being number two. And not to, like, the extent of, oh, I wanna kill myself because I'm number two. No, not like that. Not like that. More like, I'm going to do better so I can get number one! Type of number two, you know? 
Like, whatever doesn't kill you makes you stronger. I hope you liked watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!